President Museveni's directive to close Macquarie University continues to have far-reaching ramifications. The university's School of Health Sciences, located at Mulago Rifaro Hospital, has also stopped operations. Even those at Mulago, Cabanyolo for Agriculture, Mulago the Medic students, all must go home. This is bad news for patients who flock the hospital to receive treatment. Over 300 student doctors have been offering medical clinical services at the hospital. Mulago Hospital spokesperson Eno Kusasida says this has created a crisis at the hospital. Senior house officers and those are students who are doing masters. Those ones are in the university. And surely there we are affected. They are not here. And their teachers also, I think with effect from Monday, they will not be here. Um, the gap is there. I can't deny it. And it is serious. This state of affairs comes at a time when the country is grappling with low numbers of medical personnel. The, the, the interns and consultants are not enough to handle this crisis. Okay? As you know very well, the ratio that we have is that every doctor treats 25,000 patients on average. The ideal should be that every doctor should treat 1,000. So even without withdrawing these 300, 400 doctors, because the university has closed, we are badly off. So withdrawing the 300, it makes it worse. The ratio may go up to around 28,000, 30,000, one doctor, and that will increase the burden. The hospital authorities say they will try to improvise. We get our own staff to cover all the areas that these people have been covering, making sure that there is no patient, for instance, who goes without uh, getting treatment, M making sure that pharmacies are covered, or I, uh, certain critical areas like accidents and emergence, they are covered, um, ICU, intensive care unit, uh, is covered, and other areas. However, medical interns who have just graduated from several universities are still doing work at the hospital. The General Secretary of the Association, Dr. Ekwaro Obuko, says as much as the closure of the university may be justified, shutting the medical school has far-reaching effects on the country's ailing health sector. And I will not be surprised if patients in the KCC hospitals, Kirudu, uh, Kawempe, uh, Komamboga, etc., okay, and Mulago here, the remaining functional units start complaining. The Uganda Medical Association says it is engaging the relevant authorities to quickly find a solution. We were also concerned and we waited for the decision from the University Council in as far as the medical school is concerned. And this morning we received the news that the doctors are supposed to go home and as the General Secretary of the Uganda Medical Association, I consulted around. We managed to make phone calls to, to seek appointments with the Ministry of Education, Ministry of Health, and the State House to resolve this impasse. I think it's a negative thing which should be reversed. Gertrude Tumusime with Kwari, NTV.